if you come, if you ask me about Israel uh, specifically, uh, I would say that the uh, the pursuit of the war in Gaza, the way it has been done, certainly hasn't delivered uh, on the uh, objectives that uh, Prime Minister Netanyahu had set for himself, which was the destruction of Hamas. Uh, that has not happened, and it's uh, not clear that it will happen. Certainly. Uh, American intelligence, Israeli intelligence don't seem to think that this is uh, even possible. The other objective, of course, was to rescue the hostages, but it was always a trade-off uh, because it wasn't clear that uh, Israel could both destroy Hamas and release, uh, rescue the hostages alive. Um, and so it became a trade-off. And I think the government has chosen to, uh, to, to pursue the, the militaristic war of destroying Hamas. Uh, and possibly, possibly because it's not clear, at the cost of the hostages. Um, I don't know if that's a strategic failure. That is a, a choice uh, he's making, and the Israeli public will have to decide in the end whether that uh, they consider that a failure. The main challenge Israel faces in Gaza is that it doesn't have a plan um, beyond wanting to destroy Hamas. What's it going to do with 2.2 million pe- people in Gaza? Uh, What's it going to do about the uh, utter destruction of the of the housing in, in infrastructure when when there is no one outside uh, Israel that wants to step in and uh, take care of uh, public order, for example, uh, or the distribution of food when people know that they're going to be targeted? So this is the real challenge for Israel, and they have no answer for it. If Israel does not have a viable plan for the population of Rafah uh, uh, during uh, any kind of attack that it carries out, then uh, that could uh, certainly turn uh, part of the uh, part of the support it has been enjoying from the Western world against it. In the end, I think that will only trans- help further transform Hamas from a military uh, group into an armed insurgency that could operate much more flexibly in different places, including in northern Gaza.